Yo, what's up guys? Your boy Sonic back again with another video. It's been a while ever since we did the video. Little updates of the one that me and my friend Alex both direct to a video. It's gonna take some time, so don't worry. But in any case, the mob rides, we gotta wait for some time. Let's go do a little gameplay, you know, play some good games and stuff. Let's do it. Yep, so 2K24. I am ready for this game. I had to create my character. I don't know why I can't use Sorry guys, had to get myself a new one. Oh, don't worry. Just ignore that one. Yeah. So let's see. Don't worry, I put some custom matches. Don't worry, it's gonna be a little different. So let's do. Three special matches. It's the one from ambulance match, casket, and special guest referee. And let's do it the ambulance and let's do it at No worry. Mm -hmm. Don't worry. I'll get all these. I guarantee it. Let's do it at. Let's do it raw. There's me, guys. There's me. You'll see. <laughs> Let's see. Who should I choose? Let's do on I know. I know some people don't like this guy, some people hate this guy. And I'm one of those guys who hate him. Charles Robinson. Hmm. He actually, I think he got the NXT title. More easier doing NXT. I challenging you for the NXT North American title, Dirty Dominic. Let's do it. The following contest is an ambulance match and is for the NXT North American. Oh yeah, I am pumped for this guy. There's me. Yeah, I had to turn down the music for for the, for the copyright music. At least I turn it down so I don't own these copyright music. All those 
Let's not forget the title is on the line here tonight. How can I forget? I've been looking forward to this match for a long time. Yep, there's me. Here comes the greatest competitor in Mysterio family history. Are you kidding me, Corey? How many North American titles has Ray won, Cole? Yeah, that title goes back to NXT, not to the Judgment Day. I understand, fans. I'll be mad, too. I hate Dominic, too. The toughest young superstar in all of WWE and in Cell Block 6. Well, Dom has had big shoes to fill, and he has certainly done all that he can, for better or worse, to make a name for himself in this industry. That's high. Disqualifications or countouts. The only way to win is for a superstar to force their opponent into the amulet by any means necessary. After closing both doors, the remaining superstar will be declared the winner. Now, let the match be. Introducing the challenger from Richmond, Virginia, weighing in at 250 pounds, Michael Johnson! Mm -hmm. And his opponent from San Diego, California, weighing in at 200 pounds, the NXT North American Champion, Dirty. Always a big fight feel with the NXT North American title is being defended. When you land in NXT, few things seem as important as an opportunity for the North American title. Few have held it, but many have battled over it. I expect this match to be nothing short of spectacular. I've been waiting all night for this one. Placing them right where they want them, into the corner. Oh, Nail it, Shining Wizard. at the top of the ramp. Now, it certainly makes it hard to focus, but the competitor who can stay honed in on their opponent will have the best chances to win. Mm -hmm. Power bomb! The champ getting put to the test here. Oh. Hoisted up into a power bomb position, but steady punches and breaks out. Fails to connect. A springboard. Oh, here we go. This is raw power. What a gut wrench power bomb. That was a power bomb with one message in mind. Abs from the top. Oh man. I don't know if Dominic can withstand much more of this. Dominic now is going to have to dig down. No. Barrel roll. Tope. Pinpoint precision. Right on target. 
Oh. Crush with a running knee strike. Come on now. Just continuing to dismantle their opponent. The effects of this match are showing on the champ. Yeah, but you can't count anyone out yet. This match could still go either way. Thrown back in under the ropes. Opening the ambulance doors. We know what's going through this competitor's mind. And just a high proficiency of attacks from him now. Nothing is going to stop him now. Interesting choice to close the ambulance doors. Must be a defensive strategy. He's starting to climb up the ambulance. Scaled the ambulance. And now, what does he have in mind? Nothing good is up there. I'll just say it right now. My goodness, he's up there. This can only get worse. Someone driver. And there is nothing but unforgiving steel on the roof of the ambulance. This is the viciousness this match brings out in people. Tiger Bomb! This is as reckless as it gets. Ascending an ambulance, fighting up in the air, this is crazy. Put in a position now. Oh my God, no! Oh my God. Scaling the side of the ambulance, but why? He's gotten on top of this ambulance. Oh, no! Oh, no! Crashing hard onto the floor. A rough landing from the top of the ambulance. This could be the turning point. Another reversal. Eye for an eye here. Goes under the ropes to get back inside. Yep, and look at your boy. I got, like, more than... more than two finishers and finishers, too. Now uh, hooking him up. Face Buster. Now make this your time. Get them in the ambulance and slam the doors. Oh, look out! Slingshot somersault plancha. That's playing fast and loose with your own body. That is weaponizing your body. That's what that was. to clear out. Easier said than done. They are not concerned about anyone else's well-being. Ooh, the Look out below! No matter who you are, when you crash on the floor, a searing pain races through your body. Oh, oh my gosh! This fight is going down right in front of our faces. More up close and personal than I'd like to be. And he's taking on a persistent assault. He can't just think of riding this out. He has to get on offense. Outside of the ring now. What's the plan here? Everyone needs to get out of the way. Hoist it up. Canadian right. DDT, the title did, oh no, through the air, and connects. It doesn't matter if you're on the outside of the ring, there is no place safe when you face such a risk taker. Oh, Ow! squaring off right by our announce table. He steps foot in the ring again. Off the turnbuckles. What's he gonna do? Here we go. Oh, God. Straight through the heart of the table. We are through the looking glass now, people. Anything goes from here on out. This could be the end. The end of the trip.
resolve might be wavering here. Dominic now is going to have to dig down deep. Hoist it up. Hoist it up across the shoulders into a DDT. And this is the best opening to get his opponent into the back of the ambulance. This has been a jaw-dropping contest of wills. These superstars just refusing to show weakness, refusing to give up any ground. Swinging neckbreaker textbook. A warning and a challenge. As the arm trapped. This is the opening, a chance to end this ambulance match and stop this anarchy. Ambulance doors are open. Gotta wake up now before it's too late. <laughs> Trying to force the first door closed. We've got a Herculean struggle. Just has to make sure to get the other door locked. Pushing with every fiber. And they shut the door and have won this ambulance match. What a grueling victory. Let's take another look at what made that matchup so memorable. Here's your winner. What a shift into the tides with this championship match. To go from challenger to champion. That has to feel good. Unless you're the one going from champion to nothing. Yep. That was a good ambulance match. Yep, sir. Don't worry. I will go test out the other ones. And once we test out the other ones, then we can go with uh, my rise and stuff. You know, try to do a little challenging first, then do the my rise. Because I know everybody is dying to go see it. And don't get me wrong, I want to see it too. And I know, I got to give him back his titles, don't worry. Oh, that would be gone. All right, let's do the casket match. And this time, uh, I already know I know it could be women do all this stuff too. But let's go to SmackDown. Actually, let's go to Raw. Let's see who am I facing. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh my God, I'm facing Andre the Giant. Let's do it with Chad. I don't know. Actually, let's do a woman this time. Let's do Jessica Carr. All right, here it goes. Here we go, guys. Making his way to the ring from Richmond, Virginia, weighing in at 250 pounds, Michael Johnson. He's putting on a brave face now, but I know the fear is creeping up on this man tonight. Because he knows what has to be done. He needs to throw his opponent into a casket and shut the lid. He better be ready, because if not, he will be the man... Here 
comes the eighth wonder of the world. The epitome of larger than life standing right and here before from us. From Grenoble, France, weighing in at 520 pounds, the eighth wonder of the world, Andre the Giant. The tail of the tape, seven foot four, 520 pounds, neck 24 inches, chest 71, biceps 21, hands 16, wrists 11, forearms 17, thighs 36, and calves 22 inches. He's a big dude. A little fun fact, did you know that Andre the Giant? I hope they reinforce the ring. It's the first man to drink over 176. The following years. contest is a casket match. There are no pinfalls, submissions, disqualifications, or countouts. The only way to win is for a superstar to force their opponent inside of the casket. After closing the casket lid shut, the remaining superstar will be declared the winner. Now, let the match begin. Right. Here we go, and one of these competitors is going to end up locked inside that casket. You really gotta hope neither athlete has claustrophobia because there's not a whole lot of room in that pine box. I think that's the least of their concerns, Saxton. This type of match can devolve into chaos real fast. Oh, wow. Spinning kick to the gut. down like that, having the wind knocked out of you. Never a good time for that to happen. His eyes are fixated. He's looking to end this. Launching. Oh, man. Heads out, and he has all the time he wants. He's grabbed a shovel, and this match just took a sadistic turn. Looking for something, anything under <laughs> the ring. Oh my God! A sledgehammer. This is going too far. Flat line. Man, face first. And the giant can't stop any offense coming his way. We're seeing Andre in an unusual tough spot. Back into the ring. This type of match can prey on all of your fears. Corey, how does a competitor avoid becoming the victim and leave here victorious? Be methodical. Execute a strategy that does not require a lot of high risk. Land heavy shots, and when the opening presents itself, make a move to get them in the casket and pull that lift. And there was some force on that move. Incredible standing corkscrew moonsault. Wow. You really have to be confident in your athletic ability to pull off a standing moonsault like that. He gets back into the ring. And now he's really falling behind. This is where his fortitude will be put to the test. Oh, no, into the casket. Close the lid, and it's over. Can they get And they're able to fight their way out of the casket. They can't be human. That's ridiculous. This one is headed outside, guys. Uh-oh. He switches it back around. Kick to the gut. Double <laughs> under hook. Tiger ball. Giant can't stop any offense coming his way. Yeah, Andre needs to find an opening fast. Uh, 
Oh, they and slamming the casket lid onto their spine. Oh boy, to the announce table now. Oh uh, yeah, gonna clean it off here. This is gonna be dangerous. We knew this superstar had a mean streak. We didn't really the table. Adrenaline can make you do crazy things. Exhibit A, right there. Reigns down an elbow retaliation. Yeah, Brought back into the uh, ring from the floor now. He's great. reaching under the ring for anything useful. Oh, just, oh God! Now that was a harebrained idea to try that. He was trying to find a way to attack, but completely wiped out. Giant can't stop any offense coming his way. We're seeing Andre in an unusual tough spot. Uh oh! Oh God, that, that, that's a bad landing. My goodness, I think I heard something break on that crash land. Oh, he is clearly looking to destroy his opponent right now. Boom! Impact. The announce desk is turning the battlefield. Opportunity now for Andre to capture some momentum. Could be a chance for him to change the complexion of this match. What are they thinking now? Oh, my. Spiked out of the announce table. DDT. Oh, no. What? Taken out from high above. You got to be some special kind of crazy to do that. Looking for a high-risk move. Taking flight. Oh, my! They just went crashing through the table. If this were a tables match, Saxon, I'd say Mazel Tov. Instead, I'll just say my condolences. And he gets delivered back into the ring. <laughs> this could be the end. The end of the trip. Here's my super finisher. He went right into that turnbuckle. Legging vulnerable on that top turnbuckle. Talk about upping the ante. Oh man, they are up high. Top row. This is gonna be nasty. Avalanche attitude adjustment. There is no life left in him now. This could be where this casket match gets decided. Oh, look at this. Oh, man. Inside out. And the pressure on Andre continues to mount. Yeah, Andre needs to find an opening fast. It's about to get very dark in there. Trying to force the casket close to end this thing. There's no way they're going to prevent it. Not ready to put the lid on this one yet. Apparently closing that casket is easier said than done. Coming back in the ring. And he'll leave the ring for this next stretch. And oh man, Andre has been busted open. We've already seen a few shots delivered up in that region. And he has free reign to the outside with no count outs to worry about.
desperately trying to force the casket closed. Their opponent showing met. And mercifully, this one's over. Rest in peace. Here is your winner, Michael Johnson. We have our brave winner in this grueling casket match. No one wants to be put in a casket before their time, and they have to be upset about it. Upset? I'd be crying by now. Well, Saxton, you cry when your nightlight runs out of batteries. <sighs> that casket match is something else. And you know, next time, I will probably do like, can I, can I survive with this gauntlet match? And stuff. You know, all this too. You know, I'll do a challenge. Yeah, let's do a Night of Champions. Should I be a referee or should I be a superstar? Even everybody can wear it. Second, guys. Yeah, it's crazy. Cause you know, it's been a little while I try to do this. I was like having a blast playing this 2K24. You know, creating my superstar is tough. Tough as a rock. But don't get me wrong. Doing all the moveset stuff too is something else too. So heads for going to be a referee, tails will be a superstar. Yeah. Hmm. Oh, your boy's gonna be a referee this time. Hmm. Let me wear the referee um outfit. And let's see who will we see. Hmm. Try to use Cody Rose. It's gonna be for the championship, and this time it's gonna be Seth freaking Rollins. <laughs> See, Seth Rollins will take on. <laughs> on the Miz. Championship match, actually. Instead of going to be Seth Rollins, I know just the person that the Miz will probably will face. Guntar for the Air Condell Championship. And this time, let's see. The following contest is a special guest referee match. Mm -hmm. That is for the WWE Intercontinental Championship! Here's me. Well, I'm sure Saxton's pleased with this guy as our referee. I am! He's here to deliver justice in the ring. Yeah, baby. Now, here's the light. Please welcome the special guest referee for this match, Michael Johnson. You guys think he's excited to try his hand at refereeing? I don't think he wanted it to come to this in the first place. He just wants to make sure we have some law and order here tonight. Keeping these competitors in line and enforcing the rules is going to be a tricky task. Oh, 
Let's go, baby. Here's the Miz. Yeah, here's the man, the Miz, who is one of the most accomplished stars in the history of WWE. Just one of the many reasons why he is the A-lister. Yep, he's a baby face now. I know I was surprised myself, too. Let's see what he can do. Here comes the Austrian anomaly, Gunther. A man with one purpose, to prove the math sacred. Introducing the challenger from Hollywood, California, weighing in at 221 pounds, The Miz! And his opponent from Vienna, Austria, weighing in at 297 pounds, the WWE Intercontinental Champion, The Intercontinental Championship, one of the most prestigious titles in all of sports entertainment. Let's see who will win this one. It's my first time being a special guest referee since 2K14. So much history at home. And the special guest referee is up to you to enforce the rules of the match, including pinfall, submission, check in. Submission checks, wing out counts, and disqualification. You have to fool this, this creation. You have to fool this creation to enforce their rules as you choose. But WWE will be watching closely and may replace you if you fail to perform your duties. Don't worry. I am a referee. And the referee mode allows me to go check everything. Your boy, who know as a hyper king, knows it's an official. Mm hmm. <laughs> Don't worry. Attached to the Intercontinental Championship. So much weight attached to this match. Yeah, but right now it's all about living in the present, in the now. That's the only way the champ's going to get out of this with his title in tow. Gotta hurt. That kind of force in the arm can have lingering effects. With an uppercut. Foot to the belly. Oh dear, this doesn't look good. Alley oop. Oh my goodness, dribbling the up. Here's a pin for the title. He kicks out instantly. Finding the power to shake off the pin attempt. Our special referee doing the zebra stripes proud. Oh, just turn that around. There he goes, right into the corner. Oh, attacked in the midsection. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Right, the champion's down. The champion's down. Oh, my God. We're going to have a new champion. The referee respecting his job and being impartial with his count. You can tell the ref has set his feelings aside with a count like that. Followed up by another to the chest. comes the pitch into the lariat. The Miz is such a dangerous competitor. Even with all 
the skills in the world, we all know he's not above taking shortcuts. You can't fault the Miz for being smart and bending the rules to his advantage, Cole. And if you want to beat him, you can't be afraid to bend those rules either. You really have to try and beat Miz at his own game. He beats the counter. This one continues. Got to find a way to get out of this. Someone call a dentist. Kick to the abdomen. Miz turns it around. Four, two. And you can't argue with the referee's count. Our designated official being as fair and square as one can be with that count. Surveying the situation, picking up speed. That's finding any which way to topple the competition. Hurling your own body like that is insane. DDT. There are plenty of ways battling in this area could end in serious harm. Taking out the knee. The Miz shifting the match to his pace. Impressive offense from the Miz. He needs to find his way back into the ring. The count just keeps going up. He's heading back to the ring. Miz getting excited. What's he going to do? The Miz wins. Oh, he gets what he deserves for all that Here gloating. Is your winner. We got our buddy's work for that one. Take a look. Miz. The challenger unable to make it back in time. No choice. When it comes down to the record books, a win is a win no matter the conditions. They should still be proud. Let's go. Dusty Rose Classic. Next match. Okay, we got some good ones back. Let's do a, actually, let's do a gauntlet match. And it's gonna be me. WrestleMania, okay.
says, here's the official, guys. Let me see. Do we still have time? Yep. All right. Wait, we could do a tile match? Oh, wow. Okay, now that is awesome right there. We could do it sometime next time on that one. And if you want me to do a challenge, leave it down in the comments. But this time, it seems like they wanted me to join with the Judgment Day. I had to prove them wrong. And you know me, I'm not doing no Judgment Day. If I win this match, I finally be free. But if I lose this one, guys... I will have no choice to turn heel and have no choice to join the heel faction. So let's do it. So it's going to be official. The following contest is a gauntlet turmoil match. The rules of the match are as follows. Two superstars will start in the ring. When one superstar is eliminated, a new superstar enters. Elimination can occur anywhere in the arena. The match will be won if the first entrant eliminates all other entrants in the match. And here comes one of my favorites. That's me. Finn Balor has arrived. Say hello to the Prince of Judgment. And representing the Judgment Day from Bray County, Wicklow, Ireland, weighing in at 190 pounds. He is one half of the undisputed WWE Tag Team. Yeah, boys. Finn Balor. Sorry, you need and little guys know before we do this match, let you guys know the update that um I will go on live tomorrow after I finish working and all. We'll see if we can go do universe mode or you know, give you guys the updates on the universe mode. We're gonna have that, but I wanna know if you guys want to me to do a challenge or anything first or something like that. Just let me know in the comments. But in any case Let's have some fun. But don't worry. On the My Universe mode, we could probably go on live stream doing that. Or probably I could do video. Let me know in the comments if you want me to do the My Rise on live stream. Or you want me to do the My Rise on video. You know, post a video. But actually, yeah, let me down in the comments. Gauntlet match has begun. One superstar versus an onslaught of opponents. Can't say I like the odds. But what a win if you can pull it off. This could be a career moment if you can manage to defeat this parade of opponents. Many names have been made by surviving a gauntlet match. We'll see if the same can happen tonight. What's underneath the ring tonight? With all this in mind, take it from me. Nothing good ever comes from rearranging furniture. And he slides him back to the mat. No clue what he hopes to find down there. A microphone? This is about to get interesting. Oh, saw it coming. Back and forth, back and forth, looking for the advantage here. Big forearm. 
A rivalry has reached a new level when superstars collide in this combat zone. Corey, what are the keys to remember for the competitors? You gotta tee off on an opponent. Use everything in your vicinity as a weapon. It's about a competitor getting theirs by any means. The more damage you inflict, the better. This is all about total destruction. Nothing is off limits. Oh, man! Intercepted the attack with a kick to the face. He reverses it. The WWE Universe matching Balor's energy here as this match continues. <laughs> Expected that one. You can see he is feeling it now. Oh! Bam! Just one right after the other can't be stopped. Clearly hoping something nefarious is beneath the ring. I'd hate to end up on his back heavily whipping side right now. He's got a kendo stick. Oh, so many dangerous attacks, one after the other, making it difficult to regain any composure. And Balor's attack gets cut off. Slingshot neckbreaker. Nice. And Balor's being picked apart now. Finn is being worked on heavily. Into the pin attempt. in the wings. Oh, you know me. Let's do... Well, let's see. Let's see how the ramp camera looks. Damian Priest looking to make a statement in this gauntlet match. He's running into some problems here, guys. Yeah, this floor has proven to be quite the challenge for him here. Yokes up their opponent. Sidewalk slam delivered. There's still oh, another challenger. Oh, was easy. He's next. It's looking like Dirty Dom is fired up for this gauntlet. Come on, I beat Dominic Mysterio. It'll be easy. Let's go. Super kick. Yeah, there's more. Corkscrew splash to finish it off. Sometimes you just gotta show off and show out. Oh, big thud coming from the steel trash can. Don't do it. Barrel toe play. What? That is the attitude of a daredevil. The ability to take risk with. Hoist it up. Canadian rock DDT. Dominic in crisis mode. Two. The fun's not over yet. Here's our final entry. Mm -hmm. More action the on the way with the McDonough wins. headed the into the gauntlet. Now look at that. The rim camera is awesome. Looks like he has something planned with his table, guys. Oh, no. Oh, he knew what was coming. 
Kick to the gut. The setup. Up and implant buster! Consecutive attacks keeping McDonough off his game. JD's got to find his spot and take advantage. No way, no, across the shoulders. Not through the table. Into the table. That's it. He just got broken. Uh uh. No way. Shooting star. These gentlemen get after it. Here are the highlights. Here is your winner, Michael Johnson. What a gauntlet match we just witnessed, folks. This is what it's all about. All the hard work, all the training. It's all for achieving big victories like this one. I am the free man. Yep, so, so don't worry. Next time, we're going to play some time, you know, for tomorrow and stuff. So, hope you guys enjoy those three special matches, the special guests, the casket and the ambulance, and the gauntlet match. That means four, my bad. In any case, um, don't worry. You'll see me next time, and I hope you guys enjoy the video. You guys do. Leave it down in the comments and also hit the like button, subscribe, turn the notifications. And you know, um, I hope you guys have a good time. Because you know me, we're gonna have some really good time on this one. I finished the showcase, and the showcase was awesome. But don't worry, the universe mode. I put three for a reason. Probably one of these guys will be a challenge, just in case we could do a challenge. And the other one is going to be a specialty. And the third one or so, we could do anything. So, well, in the case, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. And also, as always, I'll see y'all until the next time, my hyper people. See y'all in. Peace out.